The River Cammock is Dublin's fourth largest river. It's a tributary of the River Liffey and rises in the Dublin mountains, near British village. Along the way, the river passes through Sagat, Clondalkin, Drimna and Kilmainham. The Cammock discharges into the Liffey just downstream from Houston Station. Here it exits via an artificial culvert. Along its 23 kilometre length, big changes are seen from an upland peaty area, upland pasture areas and pastoral lowlands. It's this lowland area that makes the river prone to flooding since the low gradient causes the river to flow sluggishly. In the lower half of the catchment, the river flows through a densely urbanised area and, for some of its length, the river flows underground in artificial culverts. On the 11th and 12th of June 1993, Inundation occurred in a number of locations, with severe flooding in parts of Clondalkin, including the Cherrywood Estate, shown here, just downstream from Corker Park. The park is approximately halfway along the course of the Kamuk. Two factors contributed to the flooding. First, 100 millimetres of rain fell within a 24-hour period. A storm with a return period of one in a hundred years. Secondly, this rain fell on saturated ground, as May had already been a very wet month. The flood embankment you can see was the first phase of flood alleviation works carried out in Corker Park by South Dublin County Council. It's higher than this, further downstream, where the protection is most needed. The second phase of the flood defence works was to carry out a series of excavations to create flood attenuation ponds. These allow floodwaters to be stored, protecting downstream areas from inundation. After the flood has receded, the water is gradually released from the impoundment. In total, 55,000 cubic metres of storage was created. This includes additional storage provided by two fisheries ponds. The excavated material has been used to landscape other areas of the park. The wetlands provide a range of habitats for birds, mammals and freshwater plants and animals, as well as enhancing the amenity value of the park. This virtual field trip looks at the river from source to mouth, focusing on Corker Park. You'll learn about hydrological processes, flow monitoring and about the range of flood management strategies that have been implemented in Corker Park.